with the three priests, namely Jose Burgos, Jacinto Zamora, and Mariano Gomez, who are also famously known as the Gomborza. In 1872, the Gomborza were accused of leading the rebellion against the Spaniards. Bonifacio Octavio was the one who told the current Gobernador General at the time, Gobernador Rafael de Escudero that the Gumburza were the ones who orchestrated the uprising rebellion. They were sentenced to death by the Governor General and were executed at Bagumbayan in February 17, 1872. The execution of Gumburza marked a turning point in our country's history. Paciano Rizal, the older brother of José Rizal, witnessed the execution of the three priests. He greatly influenced José Rizal when he was still young, and he sparked the fighting spirit of José Rizal to stand up against the oppressors. Paciano Rizal was also the one who sent Rizal to Ateneo and funded his education. He would constantly send money to Spain and update his younger brother of the friar's abuses in the Philippines through letters. So, as you can see, my Lolo slept again, but anyways, I have to share something that my Lolo told me. So, Jose Rizal is still regarded as the greatest national hero in the Philippines. His works and writings greatly inspired and opened the eyes of his fellow countrymen, resulting in the Philippine Revolution. And Andres Bonifacio was one of them who was inspired by his works and followed his beliefs. El Filibusterismo, his work was dedicated to the three martyr priests. Noli Metangere was also written in honor of them. There will be no revolution without the Gumburza's execution. And also, 
his brother Pashano. That's all we have for our viewers and listeners. I hope you took something away from our discussion. Thank you very much for tuning in.